The ROG Ally is an amazing piece of tech that can be used in multiple ways. It's primarily a gaming handheld, but it runs on Windows, which means it's kind of like an ultra mini gaming laptop. Typing or doing other PC things on this tiny screen isn't the most ideal without added accessories. But when you add a laptop device like the Nexstock 360, it literally turns the Ally into a laptop. If you don't know about these kind of devices, they're basically just screens with keyboards and computer peripherals such as USB-C ports, microSD ports, HDMI ports, etc. You can use this Nexstock 360 with a bunch of devices such as smartphones, computers, laptops, gaming consoles like the Nintendo Switch. I made a video on that, you can check it out in the top right corner of this video, and other kinds of devices. Since the Ally is a computer already, you can use the Nexstock as a second screen for more space for your workflow, or you can use it as the main screen like a laptop. Use cases for this setup can vary. When I use the Nexstock 360 with my Switch, I mainly use it when I'm out with friends or youth that I work with, and we play party games like Super Smash Bros on the Nexstock 360 screen, it's a lot bigger and more comfortable to play on versus using the Switch screen. This makes it the perfect portable gaming station that I can bring anywhere. Since the ROG Ally is geared towards gaming, you can use the Ally and the Nexstock 360 in the same exact way. You can bring a couple controllers and you can host a gaming session with your friends wherever you are using the Nexstock 360 as the screen and the ROG Ally as the console powering it. The only downside to this is that the battery life on the Ally will be worse than the Switch even when you're playing lighter games. But the battery life should be decent still if you turn off the Ally screen while you're using the Nexstock 360 as the main screen. Another cool use case is literally using the Ally as a laptop on the go. You can use it for gaming on the go on either screen depending on where you are. So on the Ally screen on the bus and then on the Nexstock screen at a coffee shop or something like that. And on top of all that, the Nexstock 360 is a touchscreen device, so you can interact with Windows just as you would on the Ally screen with your hands. Personally, I've always enjoyed laptops with touchscreens more because you can use your hands to quickly get things done, like zooming in and out of a photo with ease. So far, we spoke about ultra portable setups that you can take anywhere with you, but you can also go crazy if you want with the Nexstock as well. If you don't like the built-in keyboard or the trackpad and you're at a desk, you can flip the Nexstock 360 keyboard back, pull out a full keyboard, a mouse, and even a more premium trackpad for maximum productivity. You can also connect other accessories via the USB-C port on the Nexstock 360 as well, or just have a dock and connect everything to that, to the Ally. But yeah, overall, I think the Ally with devices like this gives people a lot of freedom and flexibility for any workflow or even any gaming situation. Not only can the Ally play all your games, it can also handle all your work. But yeah, that's all for now. More videos on the way featuring the Ally and the Nexstock 360. Subscribe so you don't miss those. But we out. Peace.